um, at the moment where I unpacked this pretty coasters, my brain was driving roller coaster. Yes, I have here again this little coasters. My idea is that we create some little interesting geode inspired coasters. What this work? And so I say yes. Oh my gosh, works. We open up the jar for the first time. It's also a some happy moment for me. Can you hear the sound? No, this was not the sound. Sometimes you have here. I like it totally. And sometimes you have this, that this tiny thing stick in your lead. And when you open up the jar for the first time, you have then the sound. Um, when you peel off this directly from the jar, but open up with the lead and it's so <sighs> calms me down. <laughs> oh no. I hope I can say this here on YouTube, but we are saying in YouTube, uh, not in YouTube, we are saying in Germany, gay brother from the swan. <laughs> it's the flapping. <laughs> At the other different way, we have no light. We have no light. That's too much light. Have you seen? Have you hear this? Have you see and hear this? <laughs> have you hear this with your eyes and, <laughs> and see this with your ears? Is this not mind blowing? I think at the end of the video, <laughs> you will see me at the end with a completely done makeup in my face. We are starting now with the resin. So I have created me some some um, drowsy inlay in the shape from the center of the coasters. And with this, we will create some interesting crystal parts. And I think we start with a complete full crystal part. I think these are pretty they are resistant. Maybe these tiny ones are pretty for crescendo. I think that we will use for this. I will use some UV resin at first. What I have catch me is some paper card, fresh mixing stick also from Fluid Art. I got the idea. I don't know if it work or not, but when we don't try it, we don't know it. And we need a good zip. When you work with UV resin, don't steer like in your wiping cream pot, because when you steer in it like a crazy stupid, then you bring bubbles in it. And we don't want to have too much bubbles in it. I think this is looking good now. So we have now the black tinted UV resin. We have here these two pretty coasters and we need some UV light. And I have here some where you can make your own jail nails and place this here, your hand in this oven, and then you are came out with your hand and was thinking, oh, I'm so looking here pretty. Unicorn over the black, then we have just the shifting effect. And so we go also here with the right white. At first, and create here some line.
So look, this is now what we have created and this is not awesome. This one is awesome, awesome, wow. It's really pretty. And when you are really strange on the way, and I am, you know this, I have now some next idea what we can do with this pretty thing. I will show you. We have here so much special effects in it. And I must say, I'm totally fan from this. So I will put more in it, more. I need more. And I think we all know stuck up pigs and we all love pretentious and with this i will create now in this some pretty effects believe me So before I show the resort from the coasters, um, you have seen this at the start from my video. It was a disaster day yesterday with all the funny moments. And then my camera have a breakdown and I don't have realized this. And now I came back in the studio and would like to take a look what my coasters are making and what I have found stupid me again look <laughs> what i've done this is looks really pretty this is <laughs> this little piggy crescendo in resin for real no just a joke i hope i can yes i can open up the jar it's no problem okay now you know <laughs> This little piggy crescendo looks like in resin like this. Very pretty. But now I will come to the results that I have created yesterday. Half time with you together, half time with me alone. Well, not the next disaster, please. Um, this is the TLP crescendo. This time really in resin. <laughs> and you can see what I have created here. It's um, a little bit like a geode. And this have a really pretty color shifting effect. You can see this, um, hopefully. Otherwise I will show you this in a few minutes directly on the table a second time. Then, this is also some of my favorites. TIP Unicorn in combination with the stuck up pig pretentious. You can see this maybe I have created here 
this little 3D effects in it, but they are completely covered with resin. And it looks like that you have placed there in it some gems. It's also pretty. And you have here the color shift from the blue to the dark violet tones at the dark resin side here. And at the white parts, you have some, let me think, it looks a little bit like um, TLP Velvet with a bluish color shift, but it reminds me more at Moonlight. It's really, really a cool effect. And then I create a coaster that is not so pretty. And I was thinking if I will show you this or not, but this was my first one. And you know what you don't try, you never know if it is looking good or not. And I have tried something with Flamingo and for me personally, it looks not so pretty. So we have here the Flamingo with the color shift from some you see this here at the black side again it's some pinkish purpley and then you shift over and have some green tones you can see this more at the white part that i have here created but it's not so pretty um but yes it was a test these are my two favorites and i think i will do more with this pretty ones and I have another crazy idea in my head and I believe when I don't try this today that I can't sleep at night later so I will lock the door and don't came out out of my studio and now I will show you this two pretty coasters again in another few hopefully that you can see then the whole prettiness what is this here for a hair uh yes i will show you this and then i hope you like this little chaotic video again for me but you know i'm a little chaotic and yes i hope it's not a problem for you i hope you like me <laughs> also when i am a little chaotic and yes I will show you now again those coasters and I wish you a nice day, sending best greetings and wish you many creative moments with the new pigments. Goodbye.